I didn't even know I was sleeping through my life. But then a discontinuity happened, and now I am waking up like from a dream. Wow, weird. What's going on? I'm not even sure I really want to wake up. Actually, I was just fine with how things were before. Living a shallow life, consumed with the busyness of everyday stuff, was okay for me. I think I was happy. But for some reason I don't really understand, there is a part of me that wants to wake up. There is a part of me that only wills to go on on this deeper journey. So how do I awaken out of a make-believe life into an authentic life lived in constant encounter with the really real? How do I wake up? The discontinuity has delivered me to a deeper place. I can no longer live simply on the surface of life, grasping reality only through my five senses. I am discovering my interior relational muscles. I am beginning to awaken and strengthen these muscles through interior relational exercises. I am beginning to see with new eyes and hear with new ears and feel with a heart attuned to a new depth. I encounter this interior reality almost as soon as I close my eyes. I paradoxically awaken by falling asleep within this deeper reality, my ultimate home. In my capacity for experiencing the overall mystery, I'm just as mysterious as the overall mystery I encounter. I am not merely my body, or my mind, or my feelings, or my personality. I am a mystery experiencer. I am awakening to the reality that the it I discovered through the discontinuity is everywhere. We are, at this moment, participating in one of the very greatest leaps to a knowledge not only of outside nature, but also of our own deep inward mystery, the greatest ever. Awesome! So I am mystery. And I am a mystery experiencer. What is the environment within which my new self can awaken and grow? This new self, which some have called a no-self, opens to an invisible, mystery-centered environment of dread, darkness, unknowing, absurdity, paradox, and emptiness. This environment exists within a timeless now moment that has not beginning nor end and dwells in a medium of infinite silence. The world is offered to our depth so as to lead us by means of things visible and tangible towards the contemplation of the invisible. With me the sunshine of darkness is bright. I have come to love the darkness. It is within this interior environment the contemporary contemplative chooses the practices that preserve, nurture, and expand the awakening. You are more than you think, more than you see, more than you feel. Come with me deeper, 